Would you like to know what is the most profitable option trading strategy based on real data? If you knew what the most profitable option trading strategy was, could it help you become a better, more profitable option trader? By the time this video is finished, you will know what the most profitable option trading strategy is so you can use it to start making more money today. I am Randy Perez. I'm a 21 plus year stock and option trader as well as real estate investor. If you're already a member of our community, Thank you for setting aside a part of your day to be here. If you're not already a member of this community, go ahead and click the subscribe button and bell notification. You will be joining a community of traders and investors that are helping each other become more knowledgeable and profitable. I read a comment from someone that was commenting somewhat sarcastically to another trader. The comment read, everyone in this group is making money hand over fist. For some reason that comment bothered me. I think the reason it bothered me is because I knew that it most likely wasn't true. It motivated me to do some research to see how likely it was that the person's statement was accurate, that buying options would enable everyone who does it to make money hand over fist. I'm excited to share with you what I found. What trading strategy is your favorite? Buying options? Doing spreads? Covered calls? Naked puts? In the comments below, let me know what your favorite trading strategy is. I'm looking forward to seeing what's working for you. And stay tuned until the end of this video where I will tell you where you can find some information about special techniques I use to supercharge my option trading profits and cash flow. Let's get started. The last time I counted, there were over 40 different variations of techniques that you could use to trade options. There's so many that it can literally be overwhelming, but it doesn't have to be overwhelming. By knowing what the most consistently profitable option trading strategies are, a trader can use a strategy that matches their personality and desired results to become a better option trader. There are hundreds of opinions about which option trading strategy is the best, but today we're not going to talk about opinions. We're going to look at cold, hard data to make the decision for us. This cold, hard data comes in the form of two case studies that are performed over the past 30 plus years. The first case study was performed in 2012 by the Chicago Board Options Exchange using the Asset Consulting Group. It used data from 1988 to 2011 to make its determination. The second case study was done in 2008 by James Dorian, the Bank of America Assistant Professor of Finance at Florida State University. They used a 22-year trading period from 1996 through 2006. It's interesting that both of these studies came to the exact same conclusion. I know some of you are going to disagree with the results of these studies, and just because these studies found the exact same strategy to be the most profitable one, that doesn't mean that it's the right one for you. A trader must determine which option trading strategy matches their personality in order to be a consistently profitable trader. But whether you agree with these findings or not, this information will definitely give you something to think about. And if you're new to options, it might even give you a technique that you can use to start trading options. In analyzing the 40 plus option trading strategies that are available to investors, these two studies found that the four most consistently profitable strategies when a trader uses the S&P 500 as the underlying are first the buy right labeled BXM. This is where you own the S&P 500 while selling at the money covered call options. Number two, the buy right labeled BXY where you own the S&P 500 while selling covered call options that are 2% out of the money. Number three, the put right labeled PUT, where you sell at the money cash secured puts. And finally, number four, the 95 110 caller option trading strategy labeled CLL, where you own the underlying S&P 500 index and sell out of the money call options at 110% of the S&P's value, as well as sell out of the money put options at 95% of the S&P 500 index value. Before we get to which one of these strategies is the most profitable, Let's look at a couple other factors that a trader might want to consider when using these strategies that these studies found. Let's first look at the Sharpe Ratio. Briefly, the Sharpe Ratio is used to help us understand the return of an investment, in this case, selling options, compared to its risk. Generally, the higher the value of the Sharpe Ratio, the more attractive the risk and adjusted return is. As you can see here in this chart, the put right or selling cash secure puts at the money gives you the best return relative to its risk. Second best was a tie between the two covered cost strategies. After that, the fourth best return was just holding the S&P 500 outright, and the worst return was the collar strategy. We're going to get into which option trading strategy is the most profitable, but if you're liking the video, why don't you do me a favor and tap the thumbs up button. 
It helps support the channel and it means a lot to me. And stay tuned in until the end because I'm going to tell you where you can find information on the special techniques I use to supercharge my option trading profits and cash flow. Well, let's continue. I want to share with you one more chart before we get to the overall returns. If we look at the standard deviation coupled with the strategy's performance, we see that the put right is the clear winner. It has the highest annualized return at 8.84% with the lowest standard deviation of 8.74%. Remember that in this case, we want as low a standard deviation as possible. The standard deviation tells us how volatile the strategies are, or in other words, how tightly bunched our returns are around its average. By having the lowest standard deviation, we would expect our portfolio value to be the most stable out of all five options. So we get the highest return with the lowest volatility using the put right strategy. I will briefly put up several other slides here if you want to pause and review them. They are the returns of the four option trading strategies and the S&P during the 11 years that were the most bullish. Here you'll see that the put right actually had the third best returns, but again, it had the lowest standard deviation or volatility. In the next chart, we see a 12 year period of moderate returns. Here the put right option trading strategy had the highest return along with the second lowest standard deviation. Now looking at the overall case study period, we see that clearly the put right option trading strategy had the highest return with an average yearly return of 10.8% or 4% more profitable than the next closest strategy, which was the covered call strategy of selling calls 2% out of the money. The put right strategy also had the lowest level of volatility coming in at 10.2% standard deviation. That was almost 5% lower than the next closest strategy's volatility. It's hard to beat an option trading strategy that has the highest return and lowest volatility. So the clear cut winner is the option trading strategy of selling put options. And to be frank with you, I'm not surprised. Selling put options has been my main option trading strategy for many years. It has put tons of cash in my pocket and still does on a weekly and even a monthly basis. Does this mean that this is the only strategy that option traders should be using? Absolutely not. But knowing that this strategy produces consistently high returns with lower risk, it gives us a valuable piece of information about the strategies that we should consider. I have found that selling put options has consistently produced solid returns for me with minimal risk. Just because this has been proven to be the most profitable option trading strategy, and it's a strategy that has worked for me, it does not guarantee that it will work for you. Like every strategy, it has to be implemented carefully and each individual's risk tolerance has to be factored in. It's important that option traders also understand the level of risk measured in these studies is relative to how much leverage a trader uses. In the past, I have used leverage in my trading account. I do not use leverage now. Please understand that if you use leverage with this technique, you can absolutely wipe out your account if you don't trade wisely. It's very important if you use leverage to educate yourself on the use of leverage and never over leverage your account. If not used carefully and properly, leverage can put you out of the game. But if you trade options wisely, you can get awesome returns with the lowest possible volatility. Personally, I use a combination of selling puts on mainly dividend paying stocks as my main strategy. And then once a stock is put into my account, I switch over to a covered call strategy while I collect the dividends on the stock. I do this on individual stocks, not on the overall S&P. At the beginning of this video, I told you that I would let you know where you can find information about the special techniques I use to supercharge my option trading cash flow and profit. This video you're watching is a part of a series of videos of how to trade options like a professional. The next video I will produce in this series will tell you the techniques I use to amplify my returns on my strategies of selling put options and doing covered call trades. If you'd like to get a notification as soon as that video is released, hit the subscribe and bell notification buttons below. You will see how with the knowledge found in this video today, along with some of the techniques that I use, you can decrease the risk of trading options while increasing the amount of cash you put into your pocket every week, every month, every year. Our goal as traders shouldn't be to just look at the option trading strategy that can produce the biggest winners. Huge wins are fun and awesome, but if they're followed by huge losses, then it defeats the purpose. As professional traders, we want to use option trading strategies that minimize the risk of loss of our precious capital while giving us reliable option trading cash flow. Check out our videos in the link above and in the description below where I share my monthly cash flows from option trading. 
In those videos, I share all my trades for the entire month, as well as the profit and loss of each trade. I think you'll see why I love trading options so much. The cash flow can be awesome. Until next time, happy investing, and we'll see you again soon.